Only on NBC4 tonight, Casey Goodson Jr.'s mother is speaking out. It's been three years to the day since her son was killed, but her grief is still fresh. And I'll say it because I, I, it's the truth. I just trust God, and I know that God sees and God knows, and we will prevail. Yeah. Goodson was shot by then Franklin County Deputy Jason Mead. And since then, Mead's trial has been postponed multiple times. It is finally set to begin. And for Goodson's family, it's been an agonizingly long wait. NBC4's Caleb Michael has more from Goodson's mother three years after the worst day of her life. Tamara LaPayne says not a day goes by that she does not think about her son wishing he was still here. Even three years later, she says she remembers the events of that day so vividly. My phone rang and it was my five year old. And I just, when I seen his name on the phone, I just got a bad feeling. It was a call that changed Tamara LePayne's life forever. She said Casey had just been shot. Her son, 23 year old Casey Goodson Jr., shot and killed by then Franklin County Deputy Jason Mead. The autopsy showed that Goodson was shot six times, five of them being in the back. It's been three years that he's been gone that we haven't been able to see him, talk to him, touch him, hear his voice, and three years and no accountability. Mead is facing two charges of murder and one count of reckless homicide. Mead's attorneys say Goodson pointed a gun at his client and did not follow his orders. Goodson's family and lawyers say he did nothing wrong and had a license to carry a concealed weapon. The trial has been postponed multiple times. He gets chance after chance and it's not fair because Casey didn't get a chance. Payne and the family attorney Sean Walton say a trial has taken far too long, but they're keeping the faith. We have to be optimistic and more than anything, the facts are what they are. And so if the jury hears the facts, then you know, they'll have no choice but to come back with a guilty verdict. There will be four Christmases that pass before Jason Mee goes to trial since he killed Casey Gibson Jr. His family has had to suffer um, every day. If there's one thing you'd want to tell your son if he was still here, what would that be? I love him, and, and I won't stop fighting. No matter how hard it is, no matter how hard it gets, like, we will continue to put our both feet on the ground and, and take off for him. Meet's trial is set to start in January of 2024. Tamara LaPayne says she will be in the courtroom every single day. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Caleb Michael, NBC4.